everyone, welcome back. I hope you're all doing well. So today's video is a get ready with me. I haven't actually done one of these for a while, so I'm really happy to be doing one today. We are actually off to Ladies Day at Goodwood, which is the horse racing, and I've never been horse racing before, so I'm very, very excited. We've actually been invited by Dove, who have collaborated with the amazing Gok Wan to create this 100 color dress, so I'm very excited to go and see that, and Ricky's really excited about horse racing. So yeah, we are gonna head off there in a little while, but I wanted to show you my getting ready with me little routine, what I'm doing, my makeup, my hair, and most importantly, my outfit. I love it so much, so I can't wait for you to see it. And then we're going to take you to Goodwood with us. So I really hope you enjoy it. Let's get into the video. So the first thing I did when I jumped out of the shower was put my makeup on. And I started with the NARS All Day Luminous Weightless Foundation in the colour Light 5. After that I applied my Estee Lauder Double Wear BB Concealer. Next I did a bit of contouring with Benefit's Hoola Bronzer which I absolutely love. And then for blush I used NARS Orgasm which is a really pretty pinky gold colour. Next, I highlighted my cheeks with Benefit's What's Up Highlighter. This is so, so pretty and such a lovely iridescent colour. And I just applied it to my cheekbones, my nose and my cupid's bow. And finally for my face, I used the Ambient Lighting Palette by Hourglass to give my skin a real glow. Then onto my eyes, I used Zoeva's Cocoa Blend Palette and used the colour Sweet End for my lids. For the crease, I used the colour Substitute for Love. And for my inner corners and my brow bones, I used the lightest colour, which is Bitter Start. Then I decided to do a winged eyeliner look and I'm really pleased with how it turned out. I just can't remember what the name of this eyeliner is actually called but I think it's by Maybelline. Then I lined my waterline with an Estee Lauder eyeliner and this is in a brown shade. Again, I've had it for so long I've forgotten the name of it. And then I just blended this out with a Zoeva makeup brush. I did a couple of coats of one of my favourite ever mascaras which is Benefit's Roller Lash. And then I went on to my eyebrows. I used Benefit's Precisely My Brow in the colour 3 and I just brushed them up with a little spoolie so I can get a straight edge and then I just fill them in and I'm again really pleased with how they turn out today because I'm not always. <laughs> I line my lips with a Barry M lip liner in the colour 17 and I also filled my lips in with this as well. And then finally for my makeup I went over that in a NARS Velvet Matte Lip Pencil in the colour Sex Machine. Then I went on to my hair and I decided to do my signature curly wavy look. So I sectioned all my hair off and I curled it with the Babyliss Curling Wand. And after that was done, I just brushed all the curls through to make them look a little bit more natural and spritzed them with hairspray and my hair was done. Then on to my favourite part, the outfit. So this dress I'm absolutely in love with. It's by Chi Chi London and I got it from Zalando. It's a really gorgeous bright blue, which is something I don't always go for. I'm usually in pastel colours, but I wanted to try something different. And I paired it with all cream accessories, these shoes from Lindsay, a little bag from Miss Selfridge, and the cutest fascinator. It's amazing how much confidence wearing a bright colour can give you. And I can't lie, I felt so, so confident in this dress. I loved swishing it around and walking around in it because it's so pretty. The Cream Fascinator is from New Look and I think it just finished off the look perfectly for a day at the races. And the dress actually gave me a really good excuse to test out Dove's Invisible Dry Deodorant. They say you can wear it on 100 colours without the fear of it leaving any white marks and I have to say it lived up to this. There was nothing. 
Lastly, I just put all my essentials in my bag and we were ready to head out the door and on our way to Goodwood.